My name is Valentina Salvatelli. I have a PhD in physics. And from my experience, I can say that studying science is very hard. If I'm here today, it's mostly because of two people. My mom, that is a physicist too, and that was there for answering my questions uh, about science since I was a little child, and my teacher of physics and math at school that cared about me a lot. I think that a great tutor that is there for helping you and motivating you really makes a huge difference in learning how to solve scientific problems. But unfortunately, the majority of students has not access to the same kind of very highly specialized assistance. Nowadays, however, um, everyone has access to internet. So um, it wouldn't be great to have a, a platform online that is offering uh, STEAM education uh, to everyone, no matter their background or their school of origin, uh, for free, and uh, that is fun and popular as Candy Crush. Well, actually, this platform already exists. It is called Isaac Physics. It has been created a couple of years ago at Cambridge University. And this is a very highly interactive environment with uh, a lot of questions where you can get instant feedback. And there are some hints to help the students towards the right solution. And uh, I think that that is already a great tool. I would suggest that to all the students that you know. But at the moment, the activity of the students is self-directed or a teacher can assign some homework to a group. This is not ideal. Um, there is no personalization. And in the era of artificial intelligence, we can do a lot better than that. This is what I did with my ASI project, uh, where I worked to transform the platform into a personalized system that can adapt to the needs of each student, exactly as a personal teacher would do. And for doing that, I used uh, a huge amount of data that has been collected by the platform in the form of a click streaming uh, of the users. Uh, and up to now, we have about 6 million of attempt questions and uh, 2,500,000 uh, uh, students active on the platform. And the personalization can be uh, achieved on several different aspects. Uh, I decided to start uh, with setting the right uh, level of difficulty for each student. As a matter of fact, engagement is crucial because students will be able to profit of the platform only if they will be willing to come back to the platform very often. And we discovered that a, a right balance between uh, difficult questions and less difficult questions is crucial to keep students engaged on the platform. What we have at the moment is a small group of most active students and we can notice that for them, the ratio between uh, uh, difficult and not difficult question is about one difficult question every three questions that they attempt. So if we could know in advance uh, what would be difficult or not for everyone, in that case, we could adjust the ratio of the question that uh, they are meeting on the platform in order to keep everyone very engaged. And, uh, but for doing that, the first point that we need is an example of how difficult questions looks like for everyone. And if we could sit close to the student, that would be very easy. But in this case, we had to rely uh, to infer this thing uh, from the platform, from behind the screen. And for doing that, I work with the teachers uh, in order to translate their uh, real world experience uh, in, in an algorithm that could classify in an automatic way the past events that we have as difficult or not difficult. And after th this first step, uh, I was able to pass to the second one that was predicting uh, uh, if uh, a question will be difficult or not in the future. Uh, a lot of different strategi strategies are possible. And uh, in the end, the best strategy I end up with is to combine uh, the history of the personal uh, student and the collective behavior. Only by combining uh, both uh, what the student did previously on other questions and what other students did on the same question, we were able to find uh, um, very good results. And uh, in the end, I tried a lot of different machine learning algorithms and XGBoost, that is just a, a very sophisticated version of Random Forest, uh, is the um, winner of my personal competition with 8% of accuracy in predicting if a, a question will be difficult or not for a, a specific student. 
And uh, this model will be uh, implemented on the platform. Uh, this means that very soon students will access to personalized game boards uh, the, where the level of difficulty is optimized for their engagement and uh, their learning. And I cannot say at this moment if Isaac Physics will become uh, as popular as Candy Crush, but <laughs> I'm sure that with this project, we did a concrete step uh, towards a better STEAM education for everyone. And uh, I think this is a very exciting step towards the school of the future. Thank you very much.